Hello everyone, so this recording is to calculate the descriptive statistics, especially for nominal and ordinal data. In the previous video, we have learned about how to analyze using the descriptive statistics for ratio data. This is for nominal and ordinal data. Basically, um, the steps are similar. So we click analyze and then descriptive statistics and frequencies and we have here about the variables to choose we choose the nominal and ordinal data which is this one and occupation and we click this so they move into the right column and we choose statistics because we cannot uh, calculate the central tendency such as mean and median for the um, nominal and ordinal data so we only choose the mode we will see like the frequency or the what is it most frequently occurring data also for the dispersion maybe we can skip that or we can choose the minimum and maximum and then we click continue for charts maybe the um, appropriate chart for nominal and ordinal data is the pie chart uh, you can choose between the frequencies and percentages I will choose the frequency continue and okay yeah so the interpretation is basically similar to that of the output um, of the ratio data the first is about the valid data we have here 20 valid data which means that there is no data missing and then we have the mode the mode for um, frequency to visiting the, uh, the library is 3 which is Rajin and then for occupation is number one which is pns now for the frequency table uh, for visiting to the library we have malas sedang rajin so lazy and then average and then very diligent to go to the library uh, the frequency for each malas is five and then sedang is six and rajin is nine here and the total data is 20 as for the frequency in the parents occupation we have pns six abri and pedagang five and then petani and nelayan two and the total data is 20 and this frequency is shown in the pie chart so we can see here Malas is uh, represented with blue color and then sedang is um, green color and rajin is the cream color and we see here that most of the students are quite diligent to visit or to go to the library and then for parents occupation we have blue for PNS green for abri and then frame for uh, pedagang and purple for petani and yellow for nelayan and from here we can see that pns has more percentages than the other um, occupation and later for your report you can simply copy and paste them 
so for example we want to copy copy the frequency table click copy and we can choose um, word Yeah, and we can paste them here so you have got the table on your word file however still you need to check the format for your report for example in this table we can only show the frequency and the per percentage so we can delete this one, one and we will try to format this one and we can edit the name table 1 for example if we want to use the Indonesian version we can change Okay. Or maybe you want to copy the pie chart. you directly have the pie chart okay so I think that's all for um, analyzing the nominal and the ordinal data for its descriptive statistic and how to interpret them thank you hopefully it helps you to understand about SPSS more